the energy vibration lesson for the sun moon and rising Gemini's I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um, this is the eighth week of the year 2018 and the energy vibration um, in this week is the energy of the Sun and the zodiac energy is water so it's going to be a very tranquil nice um, calm seas in this week for you um, air sign people um, the week begins from the 19th until the 25th so let's look and see what is going to transpire in your week again I want to say thank you so much for your support likes and shares I haven't said this because it has been a week it's Friday and I need to get these done but thank you so much you also have the energy of the Sun and it is the week of the Sun so for you Gemini's it's going to be a wonderful wonderful positive positive week energy of the Sun is here um, this deck that I'm using is the Lord of the Ring decks um, yeah it's not one of the most fantastic decks but you guys are having a fantastic week so Monday is going to be very very positive for you guys Tuesday you have another good day because you have the four of swords the energy of the swords is always good so it's gonna be a nice peaceful day on Tuesday so Monday and Tuesday of this week is going to be very wonderful let's see what's happening on Wednesday on Wednesday you have the energy of the nine of wands so you're spiritually protected so not to worry you or spiritually protected then as we move forward we're looking at Thursday and you have the energy of um, the, the king the knight of swords so it's going to be good for the people between the ages of 25 and 45 it's going to be wonderful this is going to be extremely wonderful extremely good so let's move forward and see what's happening on Friday on Friday you have the king of swords so Friday it's good the king of swords keep on coming up for a lot of views um, for a lot the king of swords is coming up for a lot of you um, um, Gemini's and then we have the energy of the ten of cups a happy family life on Saturday so on Saturday it's gonna be good for a lot of you guys it's gonna be a positive week on Saturday you're going to be connecting with your family and this is going to be good it's going to be nice peaceful and tranquil ten of Pentacles comes up so you're going to have help from the family so you have ten of cups on Saturday so it's going to be a positive positive weekend for you guys so it's going to be good um, what is um, transpiring is that you have the energy of the nine of swords in reverse so um, in this week the, this is what I'm saying it's going to be a positive week because the energy of the nine of swords is in reverse and it's going to be good okay so as I look at your week it's going to be a fabulous week it's going to be um, really 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 a fabulous week for you Gemini's because the weekend is going to be good it's going to be um, a wonderful connection with your family and money is going to be coming in some of you are going to have a financial help coming in from your family in the weekend Monday and Tuesday it's going to be fantastic the night of ones is coming in for a lot of you ear signs so some of you are going to be connecting with the night of ones and for the people between the ages of 25 and 45 Thursday it's going to be a very very positive day for you king of swords for the people over the ages of 40 you are going to have a wonderful day on Friday so the energy of the Sun is here um, um, for you guys and a peaceful restful time so it's going to be a positive positive week so let's see what is um, the energy of the first half of the week first half of the week you have um, the king of cups this energy of the king of cups in the first half of the week what is happening here is that um, this person is bringing a lot of um, positive energies to you and this is going to be good 
this person is bringing a lot of positive energies to you and this is going to be wonderful so whatever is transpiring this person is, is going to come in um, you know your life um, it can be for you women that this king of cups is going to come in your life and connect with you in the beginning of the week and it's going to be wonderful middle of the week is um, you know it's sort of a, um, a peaceful one um, with family and um, some of you who are connected to you know um, people between the ages of 25 and 45 who are um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius it's going to be wonderful because um, they're going to come in and teach you a lesson um, it's not a bad lesson it's going to be a positive lesson um, it's going to be good because it's going to have something to do with a connection of your family as we look at the last half of the week a very very positive um, um, situation because um, the people who are between the ages of 25 or 45 what is going to happen for you is that you're going to be connecting with the same the people of the same age but these are going to be fire people and they are going to be is a sort of a a collaboration that is going to bring a lot of money in your world some of you are going to be connecting with these people in love uh, some of some of these people you're going to realize that is your soulmate or your twin flame so or whoever and whatever that is going on you're going to realize that um, um, whoever that is these fire sign or coming in your life you're going to realize that they're your twin flame and soulmate so this is good because um, together you are going to bring forth a lot of money and a lot of um, love and money is going to be at the, 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 the end of the week for a lot of people a lot of connection with people and they are going to be bringing in love and money five of ones is here so there is going to be whatever the conflicts that you had with the king of cups it's going to be over and um, the energy of the Sun is going to come out okay whatever the conflicts was uh, Tuesday Wednesday um, the five of swords so there's a lot of changes that is going to be happening in this week for a lot of people and it's good changes coming in because whatever the energy of the five of swords coming up for you guys is that whatever conflicts there was whatever because you have the five of swords five of ones it's a lesson to learn and it's going to be okay some of you have to deal with the prince of ones he's coming back so a lot of you women are going to be connecting with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius a lot of you women and it's going to be um, a long-lasting relationship because it's going to be a soulmate or a twin flame relationship which is extremely good in um, Friday Saturday um, information is going to be coming in um, to you guys Friday Saturday um, the information that is going to be coming in is from um, a Taurus no a, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion information is going to be coming in um, between Friday and Saturday for some people it's going to be Friday for some people it's going to be Saturday and for some people maybe that's where your conflicts you are having but information is going to be coming in your weekend is you know whatever the sadness and regrets is your weekend is going to be very positive because your weekend you have a happy time with your family and there is going to be money you don't have to um, worry about your financial um, situation so again a lot of changes is going to be coming in um, this week is about lessons to be learned um, this is essential the focal point of this week is about you learning certain lessons but it's actually a wonderful week because whatever conflicts or whatever situation that has been going on um, is just a lesson that you had to learn it's going to be good because the weekend has positive energy ten of Pentacles and the ten of cups in the weekend so it's going to be a wonderful wonderful week for you guys um, whatever the lesson that you need to learn um, take only the lesson and leave the rest behind because you don't really need this it's going to be a positive week because what is happening and what is transpiring is that you're leaving um, a lot of healings are coming in 
um, for the people who had situation with the water sign people the Pisces cancer and scorpion a lot of healing are coming in and it's just a lesson um, some of you um, are connected um, to this king of cups and it's going to be just information and lessons coming in for you guys um, you have the energy of playfulness so it's wonderful it you know this is a good 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 because the energy of playful playfulness comes in so it's a week really of playfulness for you Gemini's so it's going to be a positive positive week so playfulness is a time when you let go of everything else and you kind of surround yourself with your family and wonderful energies it's not um, work has nothing to do with this week it's all about learning lessons lessons that you're going to learn with conflicts with other people and um, you're going to take it easy because um, a lot of you are going to be connecting with a lot of fire sign people and this is good oh my god um, you guys have the wheel of life this is good and um, the message is that I am guided by the cycle of life and live in complete harmony with them okay I'm guided by the sign of life this is the most beautiful card in this deck and you Gemini's have received it so it's gonna be a wonderful wonderful week it's gonna be a week of playfulness but you have also the energy of the wheel of fortune coming in your weekend is gonna be fantastic so not to worry about it okay so I want to wish you guys a wonderful wonderful playful week because it's going to be a beautiful week that is coming in namaste